Let's uh, go for now, though, Rob, to the NFL. And Asante Samuel, very good defensive back, made the Pro Bowl three or four times, four times uh, with the New England Patriots. Well, he made the Pro Bowl elsewhere, but he won two Super Bowls with the Patriots, um, 2003, 2004. So he knows both Tom Brady and Bill, Bill Belichick well. And he had an interesting tweet uh, today about Brady and Belichick splitting up. Here's Rob G with uh, what his tweet said. That's right, Chris. He said, I think Bill Belichick needed Tom to be successful. Do you think Tom needs Bill? My answer is no. Bill is known to be a defensive specialist. How many times did he have a top five defense and did they or we win the Super Bowl? Tom has always carried the team on his back with limited weapons. Josh McDaniels is the one who really raised Tom Brady. End quote. Mm. Well, I, I think, Rob, the way we've we've obviously <laughs> done this a few times, you and I going back and forth on it. But how about going at it from this angle? Would they're both obviously in the GOAT conversation for their, you know, as a coach and as a quarterback. Not for me because both were court cheating. So, they're, so it's hard Brady's for me. not even in the conversation for you. No, I can't. I would, I, I'm telling you, if I had a Hall of Fame vote and, and you were looking at everything and you know how you nitpick, I might not vote for Brady the oh, first time gosh. around. Oh, I'm just wow. tell him. Okay. You. Anyway, um, which one of them do you think either of them, both of them, neither of them, would be, for most people, in the GOAT conversation uh, without each other? Uh, like yes. With, yes. I think okay. they could be without Both each other. Both of them? No, no, no. I think Bill Belichick could be, not Tom Brady. Okay. Because I think that, that when you really look at the New England Patriots and they're winning, especially the first three, it was really about defense. And then even in the last three where Tom Brady had a bigger role and more offensive to it, the defenses made some huge stands in order to put the Patriots in position to win. So I, I look at Bill Belichick and his history, what he did with the Giants as a defensive coordinator, won two Super Bowls there. You can poo-poo it all you want. Bill Parcells was the head coach. But the bottom line is this guy's been involved in eight. Super Bowls, where he had an impact on 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 uh, all eight uh, Super Bowls, because the Giants obviously had an unbelievable defense, and Lawrence Taylor anchored that, and there's so many other great players who played on that defense. But that was Bill Belichick's defense, so I think Bill would, not Tom. Ridiculous. All right, now I don't think Belichick would be in the goat conversation, and he is right now. But I don't think he would be without Tom Brady. Um, I, I'm not. Look, he was all defensive coordinator. That's great. You don't get credit for that as as the head coach. Yes, and, you do. When you, you go you on, even, when no, you go you on, you're yes, not you even do. giving. You yes, don't you even do. give Steph Curry credit for two no, finals he you, you played do. in. No, but he you do get credit you because give Bill Belichick yes, credit because, for being a yes. defensive coordinator. Because what he took there, he, he enabled the Patriots. That we're talking about as a head He's enabled coach. the Patriots to be a there great. There are a heat. lot of play. Let me. This is my turn now. You had your chance. There's okay. a lot of. Okay, there Jason, are, go ahead. There go are ahead. a lot of. There are a lot of coaches who were great coordinators who can't do it as the head coach, and Bill Belichick was looking exactly like that before he got Tom Brady. He was, he was seven years he's coached without Tom Brady. He's made the playoffs once. Once. In seven times. We don't have to imagine we saw him without Tom Brady. He's one in seven as far as making the playoffs. And then when he got to New England, which was two seasons removed from a playoff team, was eight and eight before he got there, he goes 5-11 and 11 in his first year with Drew Bledsoe, who was a Pro Bowl quarterback. Then he starts the next year 0-2, and, and Bledsoe gets injured. Tom Brady steps in as the replacement, and the rest is history. It didn't even take a month for Brady to turn that team around. He turned it around immediately. Chris, They you, won you're, like you're, 11 straight games, won the Super Bowl, you're, you're fat, three you're of fat. the next four. 
Hold it's on, a no. shame. It's a shame that you don't. It's a, it's a shame I that you don't. It's a fact. It's a shame that you don't consider that the first Super Bowl they won, including the playoffs. Tom Brady had one touchdown, so it okay. wasn't about and, Tom Brady. And? So it wasn't. It wasn't. What, it was what, about what, the defense. What about no, what I no, just now said, it's my Rob? turn. Can what I have about my what turn? I just said? Can you I know, have you my interrupted turn? me. You All interrupted right, I me. I was turn? talking and you jumped in. But go ahead. Address what I said. You said I wasn't bringing facts. I just no, brought facts. I mean, but you're, but you're ignoring winning a Super Bowl in the regular season means nothing. They stopped the greatest show on turf by defense. It had nothing to do with Tom Brady. He threw one you, touchdown. That has something to do with the entire one touchdown playoffs. Is, is necessary. Tom Brady <laughs> coughed up the football in the playoff game against the Raiders, and they handed it back to him. The Actually, first that three was Super the rule. Bowls, the that first was three the Super rule. Bowls, Tom Brady was had nothing to do. It was Adam Vinatieri. Go watch the games, Chris. You need Go to watch, watch the games. You're it ain't about, about first, Tom Brady. You're talking about the first three Super It's about Super- Adam Vinatieri and the defense. And 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 in and in Bill Belichick's uh, in in uh, the the defense. When you talk about the defense and how good it was, they had the the uh, eight times in the eighteen seasons that Brady was a starter. The Patriots were in the top five defense eight eight times. So they always were that in half, the mix. That's not even half the time. Yeah, but that, those to are the times when you're you able to win, the Chris. You always for 40%. But that's the times you're able to Stop win. It. That's when you're able to win when you have a defense like eight that. Eight times out of 18 is that, always. Eight, eight is a lot. Are you kidding? And, yeah, and I'm keep, not. No, I'm telling the truth. Eight out you of keep, 18 ain't and even half. Keep, and you keep talking about the uh, – uh, Tom Brady did this. Tom Brady did that. They could have easily won those first three Super Bowls without Tom Brady. Tom Brady didn't put up any big numbers. Chris. Why weren't they it's any good fallacy. before Tom Brady took it's over? A fallacy. Right? Why were they five and thirteen before Brady took won, over? I mean, I mean, why uh, were they five and thirteen? They because they had a bad year. But that doesn't mean that another what, what, what quarterback changed? with that defense. What changed? They had a great kicker and what a great changed? defense. That's they had a great changed. defense with Drew Bledsoe, and they went five and eleven. If what Drew changed? Bledsoe didn't get hurt, they would have won a Super Bowl with that defense. They were 0-2 with Drew Bledsoe. No, they would have won Looking like they were not defense. even going to make the playoffs. With that defense, Christian. Well, why yourself. were they 5-11 and 11 the year and before, Rob, if the defense later, was so great? Even the last three, when you look at what the defense was able to do, that Atlanta game, they didn't let them score in the second half after they were up 28-3. to That's why Tom Brady was able to come back, because the defense held them. All right. and, and, and also, they made the big play to help Tom Brady win in Seattle. A defensive interception. That's what won the game, Chris. That's another defensive play. You, you, you're acting like none of that happened. That's why they won. Stop with the Tom Brady love. It's terrible. It's sick. Stop being a Tom Brady homer and look at the games. Look at the defense. I just named two of the last three Super Bowls. The defense won it. It wasn't right. Tom Brady. All right, now it's my turn. And it ain't it ain't nothing sick about it because ain't ain't no sickness. It is sick. All right. No, it ain't sick because it ain't there. It ain't that level. I bring facts. All right. So here's the facts. You up there just all, all emotional about it. The second, the second Super Bowl they won, the score was 32 to 29. Okay? 29 points they gave up to the Carolina Panthers. Tom Brady had to put up 32. So don't tell me that was just about defense. Then we go to two, th- the, the two, lo- two of the losses in the three Super Bowls. Tom Brady put them in position to win. In 07 against the Giants, he leads a drive, 80 yards, 12 plays, and they go ahead with two and a half minutes left. And Bill Belichick, Mr. All-Time Great Defensive Coach, gives up an 83-yard drive to Eli Manning. If he could have held the defense, if his defense was so good, they would have held Eli Manning and stopped the Giants from taking the lead away when Brady had just given it to him. And in 2011, virtually the same thing happens. They go on another 80-yard drive, the Giants, and score with less than a minute left to go ahead. Talking about watch the games. Then in 2017, the same thing happened. They go on a, The Eagles go on a 75-yard drive in the fourth quarter and score with two minutes left to take the lead. A backup quarterback. 
Tom Brady has 13 game-winning drives in the playoffs. 13. That's more than twice as much as any other quarterback. That's more than Joe Montana and John Elway, who were second. From Hold on. No, they you had your chance. From you had your chance. Let me Brady's talk. Brady's offense was Rob, terrible. I let Can I you talk. Your question? No, no, I'm not throwing out a question. I didn't ask you a question. I'm, I'm giving facts. No, they're not you, facts. You asked, no, I didn't they're, ask they're a question. Facts. They're not facts. Rob, I let you talk. Now, Tom Brady's 13 game winning drives in the playoffs are more than. John Elway and Joe Montana combined. And they're second and third in game when it uh, drives in the playoffs. They got 11 combined. Elway second with six. Tom Brady's got six game winning drives in the Super Bowls. In Super Bowls. I'm giving you facts, dude. And you sitting here with emotion. You don't even remember the games. They're You're talking about facts. it was They're all defense. Because how are they what you, didn't, you know why? Because you didn't mention how Tom Brady got them in position to win the game. The How'd Super Bowl over Carolina. The kicker kicked the ball out of what? bounds, Is Chris. that a part of the game? No, but that's, yes, that's a part of the game. You didn't mention that. But when they had Randy Moss, they were averaging 35 points a game, and they and? scored 14 in the Super Bowl. That was Tom Brady supposed to be the greatest quarterback. What happened? Oh, he, he is the greatest quarterback. Them. No. Everybody so, so all of a sudden, Tom so Brady was you. terrible. That's what you're not mentioning. Really? He was Tom terrible? Brady played under no, he was 35 human. points a game. They tore up the league until it came to yet, Super Bowl. And yet, and yet. And that's what I'm talking and yet, about. And if you talk about an NFL defense that gives up 14 or 17 points, you should still be able to win a Super Bowl if your quarterback is the GOAT. Stop with all that Hold nonsense. Hold on. Tom Brady has won six And you playoff, mentioned the Eagles six, games. Tom Stop Brady. with the stats. Tom huh. Brady, no. I, why? Because they're facts? Because no, I'm spitting because facts and you're spitting feelings? You're the facts same thing. always matter. You mentioned the Eagles. Tom Brady turned the football over with two and a half minutes to and go. And he also Do you threw remember that, NFL Chris? playoff Do you remember record that? 505 he yards. Gave up the, he gave up. He coughed up the football. Do you remember Tom that when Brady, the game was on Tom the line? Tom Brady has won six yes. playoff and games. And the last Super Bowl, he go had ahead. no go touchdowns. Ahead. It was defense that won that Super Bowl. You know it. Stop it. Tom Brady has won six playoff games when the, when the opponent scored 28 or more points. No other quarterback has won more than two. So stop it. You got an excuse for everything. For Aaron Rodgers, oh, the defense doesn't do anything. The, the, the defense was the, was the key when Carolina scored 29 points. The defense was the key when Philadelphia scored 41 the defense was the key when the Falcons scored 28 in the first half? Foolishness. The Maboat, Macoat, whatever you are, the most in a, inobjective of all time strikes again. You're making up words Unbelievable. Now. Unbelievable. What do you guys think? Would either Tom Brady or Bill Belichick still have been a success? We, we think, I think they would have been successful. I think Brady would have Super Bowls and be elite and a Hall of Famer, I don't think Belichick would be in the GOAT conversation. I don't think Brady necessarily be the GOAT, but he'd be a Hall of Famer. But Rob thinks Belichick would still be in the GOAT conversation, correct? Rob? Is Rob Parker there? Yeah, Crickets. I'm here. Would, 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 would Bill Belichick would still be in the GOAT conversation, you're saying, right? I've already said that. Uh, Bill Belichick I'm, I'm, more I'm so than Tom Brady, yes. All right. There's, there's that, no doubt it. in my mind. Would Brady or Belichick be in the GOAT discussion without one another? Your turn to weigh in. Let's see what they think, Rob. All right, let's kick it off with Fred in Utah. You're on the Odd Couple Fox Sports Radio. What's up, Fred? Hey, how's it going, guys? It's first time calling in. Love the show. Um, Thanks, you made it. How's, hey, yeah. Fred, what's going on in Utah? How are you guys hanging in? How are we doing good? Um, I'm at a university, so I teach online anyways. I just got crazy kids at home but other than that it's all going good yeah okay <laughs> cool cool <I> got <laughs> so um i guess what, I, what i'm thinking is you guys it's, it's a, an idea of the system and the coach versus the player does the system carry the player does the player carry the system and in my mind i've always got to weigh it more towards the system when's the last time you've seen a great quarterback overcome a bad system you know 
Peyton Manning, maybe. I mean, that, that's why I put him as my number one guy of all time. I mean, he pretty, he carried the Colts with nothing. Um, in my mind, you look at a you look at a Brady, and you want to see what he looks like without um, Belichick. Look at Philip Rivers. That's his career. Oh right my, that's probably it. You know what? How Philip spot Rivers. on, Fred? Spot he, he on. He wouldn't. He would throw as many interceptions as Philip. He Rivers. just wouldn't win. He would just be playing, putting up numbers. People think Philip Rivers is a Hall of Famer, Chris. No, a I lot mean, of I'm not do, saying he's not right? good, but he. No, like, Brady saying, doesn't throw that. Brady's win. not that reckless. No, I'm just saying in general, you know he that. hasn't always been that bad. You know what I mean? But yeah, but but that's that's Philip Rivers. All I know is we we have the record, and and Belichick's isn't good without Brady. That's James in Detroit, fact. you're on the Odd Couple Fox Sports Radio. What's up, James? All right, what about James? Terry? No, 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 he's not there. Oh, Terry okay. in Boise, Idaho, you're on the uh, Odd Couple Fox Sports Radio. Hey guys, what's going on? What's, what's up, up, Terry? Man? How are you? Oh, doing good, brother. Staying away from the sweet and sour sickum. I hear you. <laughs> right. That's right. Hey, uh, so my, I have a theory. I mean, I could be completely 100% wrong. I'm not a Patriots homer or fan or nothing. I'm a Raiders fan, so I kind of hate Brady and Belichick equally. Because they killed you. They um, stole, a, they stole a, a, a possible Super Bowl from you guys. To be honest, I don't think Tom Brady would be who he is without that little uh, tuck rule deal. That, that, was, that, was, that was actually that, a rule. That was Everybody very acts lucky. like that wasn't the rule. But that was, was very lucky. Le- no, he fumbled the football. He that was the, the rule. Oh, was no, not under the tuck rule. He didn't yeah, put the yeah. tuck rule in. It wasn't like it was new. It was the rule. And they, but, they dug back in the archives of like 1910. Yes, they did. That that no, was a, there had been, there anybody had watching been that game, games. There anybody been watching that games. game knows it was a fumble. Look it everybody. up. There have been several games, even fumble. recently uh, uh, at that time, where it was a, the tuck rule was in play. But that was I, a look, fumble. I agree. I don't think Brady would have six Super Bowls without Belichick. I just think he'd be – I still think he'd be elite and a Hall of Famer. But I don't, I don't think he'd be six Super Bowls. Matt in Louisiana, you're on the Odd Couple Fox Sports Radio. What's up, Matt? Hey, guys. How y'all doing? Good, man. How are you? I'm good. Fantastic. Thanks for asking. I just wanted to argue the one point that Chris had about uh, Brady and his comebacks in the playoffs. you got to factor in that there has been less parity in that division than any other division the entire time Brady's been there. And so it's been easy for him to get those marks because they're always going to be in the playoffs based on how bad Miami, Buffalo, yes. and, the and the Jets are on a consistent basis. I mean, one of those teams may do well here and there, but Brady's going to have all the playoff records because that division has been the worst division overall with the back three than any other division in the NFL while Brady has been there. I'll Here, let y'all discuss. Here's Thanks the that. thing, though. Thank There's you. three other divisions in the AFC. And if you were just running roughshod over a weak division and weren't that good yourself, it was showing the playoffs, and you get beat by the other division winners. But that well, doesn't I'll happen. It, I'll give you that part, but he gets in there more than any other quarterback – in the NFL, based on how bad his division is, so Man, he and, 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 the, and he gets and the other, That's and the like other saying part, Jordan, when and the Jordan, other part, the, the East, when Jordan, you know, no, David and Robinson, people Elijah, use it against they LeBron. Were all in the West. Well, people use LeBron, it against LeBron. But LeBron's lost in the finals. No, I'm but I'm talking about to Jordan, get to the eight, to get to the eight straight I NBA know. finals. They use that against LeBron because the East was weak. Would, yeah, yes or no? but if he no, but the point is this. When Brady, if LeBron got to the finals and won more, then we wouldn't say that. No, but it's still because you get has to the finals advantage. and lose. Because now I you're get facing that. superior conversation. Conver- but but to be able to get there, and even when they win the division every year or or rack up wins, they have an easier shot because all you got to do is win two games and you're in the Super Bowl. It's it's an easier. But they road. do it. They yeah, do but it's still it. An that, easier that, that, road. It doesn't matter. They do still, it. Still, you have home field, Everybody, every, and all you got to do is win two games. If the other division winner is all that, then they'll beat you in the playoffs. Yeah, but you're and automatically with happen. six wins. There's on no that, way in to be little what they yes, do. Yes, it is. The division's terrible. The AFC least. Brandon, you don't in get to New the Mexico Super Bowl for winning the you're division. The hey, I how's it going, guys? Sports Radio. What's up? What's up, man? Hey, hey good, man. It's good. Um, the only Hall of Fame that those two should be in is should be in the Hall of Fame of cheaters, first round ballot. <laughs> Thank you. They don't even have to go in; they just automatically in there. 
all the records should have asterisks. All the championships should have asterisks next to them. They're nothing but a bunch of cheaters, you know. And you know what? We'll find out down the road when that book comes out, Brandon. And they I hope expo- so. They expose it. I'm telling you, eventually it'll all be exposed and all the stuff that they've done. I'm convinced of that because that's I the stuff too, they, got, they got. I'm convinced of it. Yeah, I am Why too. I don't, I don't like how all yet, these people, then. I don't like how all these sports analysis, you know, praise Tom Brady and the Patriots. They're nothing but cheaters. It's been proven multiple times. It's like you guys bash the Astros, you guys, you know, bash all the other known cheaters, and yet you praise Tom Brady and exactly. the Patriots. Exactly. And, and, Bra- and Brady, Brady got, got busted. The Brady got ball. busted and suspended, and people act like it never happened. Whenever they talk yeah. about Tom, they don't even mention nope. it. He it's paid never even price, a part of the and conversation. He came back, and the next game, when the balls weren't deflated, they ran rough shot over the t- opponent. It's it's still the point. <laughs> Stop it, Chris. Stop it. He Stop. did. It's Stop it. There you go. That's Tell him. Fact. <laughs> Stop it. Belichick was cheating the first time. Brady, I wasn't on Brady. And and who does that help? Knowing the defensive signals of the other team. Does that but help Brady or that, not? But my point is, did no, Brady but then who know does that, that help though? Who does that did help? Brady willingly cheat? That time, when when he was asked, he by probably NBC had no News, idea what is Tom Belichick Brady a cheater. Doing. He said, "I don't think so. I, I'll never forget that." Peter Alexander asked him that question. This was, but yet game. when you cheat, is, is Tom Brady is a Gaylord cheater? Perry a cheater? I don't, I don't, I don't think so. <laughs> Gaylord Perry was never suspended by the league for uh, was he a cheater? The ball. I'm was asking you. Did he doctor Tom the Brady's ball? a Tom Brady is has been branded, uh, suspended, fined. He was a cheater. He, they caught him. Did Gaylord Perry cheat, Rob? Uh, he never got he never got suspended. Did, did by he the cheat? League. That sounds like a I don't think so. Answer. No, it doesn't. <laughs> That's exactly no, what it does. No, it doesn't. I'm giving you, you know the, he I'm cheated, giving you the and fact. he's in the I'm Hall of Fame. And so are several others. All right.